back to my channel. If you're new, hello, hello, hello. My name is Karen and I do unboxings and a lot of stuff beauty related. So you might want to stick around. So today I have my BoxyCharm paid box. We're going to see if it is much better than the PR box. Although I was very happy so far this month. Actually, I think this is my last box. Yeah, I've cut down a lot. Okay, so this is the BoxyCharm base box. It's an actual real big box this month, but we're going to go through it and uh, let's see what we got here. All right. Oh, okay, okay. Yes. So we've got a card, and if you don't know, BoxyCharm is $27.99 a month. You get to choose one item in your box, and it comes with a card. It tells you a little bit about the products and the prices. I'll put all of that on the screen for you. We do have a $1.99 handling fee now, and BoxyCharm is basically Ipsy and vice versa. So yeah, that's just how it is. All right, let's see what we've got in here, and we're going to start off with the palette, which is something I usually do last, but let's just go ahead and get it over with. Let's just dive in, shall we? We have an iconic London desk to dance eyeshadow palette. It is called, here it is here. Now, iconic London, um, I basically, when I get these palettes, cause I've never bought one, I use them once and then that's it. So here we are here. I might not keep her. So I'm not going to swatch her, but I do want you to get a really good look. I know that these, let me just see, it is $62. Stop it. I've used these palettes before and the formula was not $62 worth. I mean, no. We do have a little bit of what looks like foil speckles in this shadow here, but a lot of them are shimmers. So yeah, it does look super pretty. Now, if you are a diehard iconic London eyeshadow palette girl, gal, boy, let me know that down in the comments because I'm curious because this is not something that I would buy. I definitely wouldn't pay $62 for it. So, all right, we got that out of the way. Let's see. Ooh, Tress Loose Beauty. I did do this in my other unboxing video. I want to say it was my PR box. And it is a highlighter palette. It's got a $26 value. It has a mirror. And here are the shades. She is gorgeous. But I'll put swatches for my other video in here for you so you can see them because I'm not going to swatch her twice. I don't need to dirty up two palettes. Okay, then we have something by Half Caked. Oh, it's brushes. It says it has a $25 value. We'll just see about that. Okay, now a lot of people are like, oh, brushes are so soft, and they are, and that's an awesome thing. But you need to find out whether they're floppy, what they would be good for, or if they have control. And this here does have control. Let me see what it says there for. Concealer brush duo. Okay, so this is not a concealer brush. This looks like more like a foundation brush. It says complexion brush. And at some point I will get the paper off. It is soft and it does have control. So this one is like blending. I'm, I'm guessing they would use this for foundation and then you would use this for powder to set it. At least that's what they look like they would be for. Okay, so that had a $25 value. Toy Factory, what's it? Super Set Hyaluronic Acid Setting Spray, $24 value. It's a new launch, it says. Okay, wait a minute. I've never heard of Toy Factory before. You would think that, you know, it's toys, <laughs> but hey, you just never know. I don't know. Maybe they were stuck on a name and they just went with something. Who knows? All right. So mm, let's open her up and see. Um, I like the aerosols as opposed to the pump. See, like mm, sometimes they just spray too much. Actually, you know, that's not bad, but it smells like um plastic. Like it's from a toy factory. Oh, yeah. I don't like that scent. Let's try her though. Mm, okay. Ooh, yeah, I don't like the scent at all. <laughs> the last thing we have, I did get in my other box. 
the Tahitian, it says breakfast. What is going on with these? Dewy collagen face primer, like breakfast, like what? Okay, wait, I've got one here. Yes. Yes, I do. Okay, so this is what it looks like. And it really is just like a moisturizer, to be honest with you. Oh, but it smells good. Oh my gosh, that is a really good scent. So that's everything. I will total everything up and put it on the screen for you. But let me go ahead and recap. We got this. <laughs> and then the brush set. The Do With The Gods primer. The highlighter palette, which is awesome. And then the Iconic London. I love getting eyeshadow palettes. So for me... This wasn't bad. Um, overall, it's like $32, I think, with shipping or whatever, or with tax, I think it is. They don't charge ship. I don't know. But anyhow, that's everything that I got. Um, I'm pretty happy with this box. I have to say I was pretty happy with all my boxes from BoxyCharm. I got the Tarte Takeover box and the base box in PR, and that was amazing. Had I known I was getting the Tarte one, though, I wouldn't have bought it. <laughs> so... I got that one coming too at some point. Who knows when it will arrive? But if you are a diehard unboxer, let me know that down in the comments. Let me know what you think of my box. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. I appreciate it so much. I love creating content and I'd love to get to know you if you're new here. If you're returning, y'all know I love you so very much and I'm so excited to get to ch the chance to chat with you down in the comments. So if you're new, introduce yourself and I will see you guys real soon in another video. Bye.